Replacing the exhaust blower on stoves made by Sherwood Industries to include most Enviro, Regency, Vista Flame, and Hudson River models. All of these stoves will have the motor located in exactly the same spot. It's going to be on the back left hand side and you're either going to remove a panel, open a door, or in some cases such as this Enviro Empress, you're going to have to remove the whole rear panel to access the blower. Once the panel has been removed, the blower should be exposed. Listed part 50-901 includes a motor with housing. To remove the housing from the stove, a 10 millimeter socket will undo these five bolts and the whole thing will come out from the stove. Make note that the low limit is not included and must be reused. Also, the tailpipes on this stove and all others is model specific and also must be reused. On this Enviro Empress, this tailpipe allows an offset motor to go perpendicular to a wall. The most common replacement is just the motor, and that's what's shown here. It's held in with six screws that go around the perimeter of the hub. Once you remove the motor, make sure you don't lose these screws. There's not very many threads holding them in, so they kind of need to stay there. And if you're not replacing the low limit switch, this is a very good time to clean it. Install your new motor with the gasket, tighten up the screws, and then connect your wires back up. Here is a wiring diagram in case you need to know where the wires go. And you're done.